It's amazing how many features we forget about within Word, or perhaps we never actually knew they were there to begin with. I'm often working with numbers within a Word document, and there are times when I need to add them up. You're in the middle of a paper, you've got some numbers, you can't really be bothered going to the calculator or opening up Excel, and you just manually count them up. Word is there, and it can help you out by doing it automatically for you. Very simple function. If we're in a table, we get, let me get into the table, we get table tools. And on the layout tool, we have a formula. And the formula will let us add a formula that will make an average, a sum, or count. So for example, if I'm wanting to add these two numbers together, I click on formula, it's given me the possibility of sum left, which is what I want, and it's added the two numbers for me together. Down here, if I want to know the total of all the scores, again, I would go formula, and it's being intelligent enough to go sum above, and it's given me the total. Well, actually, I don't really want a total of all their scores. That wouldn't be quite appropriate. What I'd really like to know is the average of their scores. So I'm just going to change the word sum to average and OK. And now I've got their average score. I'd like to do the same here. Now it's doing again the automatic, it assumes that sum above is the sort of thing that you'd usually be using this for, and it's probably what you would usually be using it for, but I want another average. Whereas here, now I want to take the sum to the left, if I go formula, it's giving me sum above. Well, it's a nice that it's done that, but actually I want to go the ones across. So. A shortcut way of getting it to go across is to do the formula now at the bottom and now it knows there's no number above so it's looking to the left so it's done some left so if I repeat that this way uh, I don't have to retype what the formula is going to be now this one here I'm going to remove so it will do it for me automatically there we go and the last one here and it's added them all in now this is fine, uh, and interestingly, I can change my numbers here, but this is not like Excel. When I change my number there, oops, I didn't mean to press enter, uh, it doesn't automatically update my table. One limitation. So if you're doing this by a link to um, Excel, fine, you can get things to automatically update for you. But uh, I can come over here and update my field the bottom here I've made a change to one of my values I'm going to update my field so those two have now updated based on the value that I changed up here because it's going to appear in two different places so as long as you remember to use your update field then you're fine the edit field here uh, lets us come in and have a look and there are actually a lot of different functions that you can find within Word we're interested in the formulas so we're going to be editing our formula here so remember if you've got numbers that are in a table, very easy to get what you want. And if you don't actually want them in a table, if you want to take them out of a table after that, just copy them and then paste them as text outside of the table and you've got that.